Astronomy Online students and welcome to week 8 of your online course. So this week we dive into chapters 13 and 14 on stellar evolution and death. So we're going to cover stellar birth again even though we kind of already talked about protostars with the formation of our own solar system and our own sun. But the same process holds so we'll kind of cover that briefly. Then dive into how stars live out their life, the evolution, and then finally how they die. Um, and we'll talk about how this all depends on a star's mass. Okay, so that's kind of the whole overview for the for your week. It's a really great couple chapters. Um, I provide you a lot of good videos. Um, a guest lecture from one of the astronomy faculty here at Mesa College. Two of my lecture videos and a bunch of that Crash Course Astronomy lectures. So they're all about 10-15 minutes long, but do leave time to watch all those videos so you can get the full picture of stellar evolution. So this week, um, just like our normal weeks, you have your week prep to complete, your homework assignment, um, your reading, and then this week we don't have an activity, but instead we have another great discussion, this time on binary evolution. So please avoid trying to look up anything online. This is all about just using our brains um, and really having a good discussion. So I want you to really think about how a star will evolve when they're in a binary situation. So read the discussion prompt. Post your thoughts and try to keep your thoughts kind of limited, um, maybe even in bullet point form, just really easy to, to digest. Um, and then really start the discussion back and forth with your classmates so we can come up with a clear overview picture of how we think these stars would evolve. All right, um, I hope you're doing well. Remember, if it's your week to complete your current news assignment, you should receive an email from me. And make sure that you're sending me the URLs that you want to complete your assignment on. Um, you submit that on, on Canvas, and then I will post it to our course Twitter page, which you can see our tweets that are coming out on the home page. So if you have any questions at all, please feel free to contact me. Um, give me a call or email is always the best. I'm here to help. All right, have a great week, and I'll talk to you guys next week.